Hello and welcome to the course on Unix Bash Scripting. This video is a continuation of previous videos on Z and in this video we will use Z to find and replace certain strings. Uh, first thing uh, we will see how we can find and replace a string in a Z. So first let's check our input file input.txt and uh, this file contain around 11 lines and how uh, Z will process it will take each line one by one in the backend like uh, so it will take line by line and uh, do the processing uh, say for example I want to replace uh, shell uh, with something okay I have shell in multiple line so I'm going to use that so use Z then S for substitution and uh, which shell I need which string I need to search and uh, replacing string I'm just using xxxx right and ending single code so this thing should be enclosed in single code then uh, my input file so what it will do the set will process the line by line and on from each line okay if that contain shell that is replaced to uh, this xxxx and uh, here you can see in one line uh, we have multiple uh, shell so what will happen to that so whether it will replace that or only the first occurrence see here you can see the shell is replaced here also shell is replaced here also shell is replaced but here you can see only one occurrence of shell is replaced but the remaining two occurrence are there so that is a default behavior so it will uh, replace the first occurrence from each line okay so if you want to uh, replace all occurrence in a line use G option so G stands for global replacement so don't confuse okay the G is for a uh, line specific no by default it will process all the line and replace but in a single line if you have multiple occurrence and if you want to replace that use this option G so here you can see uh, that is replaced suppose if I want to replace only on the second occurrence so here I can use the two so two means it will check each line and uh, the first occurrence it will leave as it is and the second occurrence it will do but in here we don't have the second occurrence okay if we add the second occurrence here okay here also uh, we can see that difference right so let me just clear and uh, do this so uh, instead of G G means the global replacement so that means everywhere in the line so if I use the number so it will use that number and uh, that particular position or second position only replace here you can see the first position is as it is and uh, second position is replaced or second occurrence in a line so not the second line so it take line by line and in from each line so whether it's matching and matching if it's matching then the second line which is matching or second uh, string it's matching with this so here first occurrence leave it and the second occurrence it will replace but uh, uh, I think uh, here uh, apart from that we have only uh, one uh, shell here other than that uh, the, the, this one is not replaced because this is the first occurrence and uh, if I want to do the second occurrence onwards everything replaced see two and third but here only uh, two that is it so uh, second occurrence to the end and uh, next uh, I, I will show you how to select a particular line or set of line for replacement so if I just use the set S yes. shell so it will replace on a each line it will consider each line and replace whenever this shell is present in any one of the line say for example I want to uh, do only on the first line so what I can do is so here just use one S yes. so that will consider only the first line and the first line doesn't have that so that that is why the reason the reason is the string as it is so if I take the second line you can see the second line is as it is 
so if i want to do it on the ninth line alone use nine so here if you use the line number then it will consider only that particular line and uh, do this processing the processing here is replacing shell with uh, this way this string okay and uh, so for example if i just want to uh, use s yes, like uh, 9 to 11 see from here to here so i hope uh, this is very clear so i will be adding uh, one more video uh, for this so and uh, also for regular expression i will be adding separate video so if you have any doubt so please uh, leave your uh, comments in the comment section i will try to answer that also if you have not subscribed so please do subscribe so i'll be keep uploading lot more contents over time thank you for watching bye